We got to learn to uh, trust your wife. Now, granted, you're not going to be like uh, Envy, who's, and I, and for the record, I respect DJ Envy and his wife, Gib. Matter of fact, I will be uh, seeing them next month again. Um, you're not going to be, of course, your husband's never going to let you go on a uh, three day girls trip or whatever the girls case may be. Where? Anywhere down the block, for all I care. It ain't going to, like, I'm, Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me readjust my seat for this one because you're making this facial expression. Go ahead. I want to hear this. What's supposed to happen on this girl's trip? Any, uh, whatever happens on the girl's trip. I don't know know about a three day, but I did do a two day recently. Oh, no, 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 no. Envy's idea went on a three week girl's trip. Oh, oh no. I can't even be far from my kids for that long. I'm good. Okay. And not, not a three week nothing no but like when i went for my uh 10 year high school reunion i was by myself he didn't come um he did come to my 20 year reunion though um and if like one of my home girls or something like that want to you know hey you know i got this i got this cabin da, 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 or i got this lake house this that and the third come on down for the birthday i'm going okay what me? Like, what's uh, supposed to be happening? Are we supposed to be inviting strippers to the to, to the thing? Like, what are we talking oh, about? No, no, no. <laughs> Just uh, see, when it comes to girls trip, or at least uh, your girl groups, you guys all have a lot of similarities, but no one's the same. There's gonna be the classy lady, the cool lady, which will be you, um, the quiet lady. And the buck wild lady. The buck wild lady tends to go overboard and put everybody in a compromising position. So, and when I mean compromising, meaning it could compromise one's uh, marriage. So, how would somebody? How would what somebody else does compromise my marriage or a marriage? Well, it's it's the fact of uh, temptation. Me personally, I tend I tend to uh, stay away from temptation as much as possible. The only reason why, if I have to go in a uh, situation that I don't want to be in, is because I'm at work. Everybody knows what I do for a living. However, um, I'll put it like this: Let's say if I'm with my guys from uh, from uh, uh, college. Matter of fact, one of them, I won't say his name, had a private party at his house that he recently posted on uh, his close friend's stories on IG. I would not, me going there would compromise my marriage for the simple fact that although I'm not going to engage in those activities, the fact of me being there is going to open a lot of questions. I screwed up for being there to begin with. Whether I did nothing or not, I should never have been on that premise because I might have had an idea of what was going to go on. Or if it came up to my surprise, I should I should have exited the situation versus stay. Or call and say what's going on. Be like, hey, man, you know, so you know how so-and-so is. Such and such. Man, blah, 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 when blah, 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 has blah, blah. that ever worked in man history? Man, you know how like, you know how you know how homeboy is. He 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 wild and that type of stuff. A woman's eyebrows gonna raise up. She's gonna slip, lean back on. She knows who your friends are. (laughs) Not if she knows who your friends are. Right, right. That's true. Very well. Then she knows what type of time he be on, and either she trusts you or she doesn't. Mm Hmm. I get okay. That's fair. That's 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 a good uh, way of uh, saying it. I'm definitely gonna quit this part. Be like, ladies, you're headed here first. If you know your husband and you know he's good. And you know he ain't down that way. It doesn't matter what scenario he needs. He's gonna uh, be in. Just know that he's faithful. But um, me, I'm never gonna go in a situation where some things could be taken out of context. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I get, I totally get your premise, and you know, I overall agree. Yes. So yeah, and it's like, see, my wife. Uh, if me, I will definitely let my wife go on a. Uh, 
uh, a girl's trip, maybe. And granted, she's not, but she don't want to be gone. She no more. She don't want to be hanging around people like that. And number two, she knows that she's a wife first, a mother second. She got responsibilities to do here. So at the most, she'll probably be gone for like, if she ever goes, she'll probably be gone for three days. If it's not a business trip, like if her job needs to go gone for like longer than a week, she'll probably do her three days, go relax, chill, and uh, come back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think the longest I've been gone away from home would probably be about a week. Um, and that was on some family stuff, you know. But mm-hmm. um, other than that, I'd say probably like three, maybe five at the most. And I want to say maybe it was five when I went to the reunion, but I'm not even sure. Because, you know, niggas still got to go to work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I only been gone. Hold up. Have I ever been gone? I got to ask. I don't think I ever left this. I don't think I've been gone for them that long. I know my wife been I'm gone for like five days, three separate times for work. But me, I don't think I just just chill at the house and chill at work. But that was an interesting take. I appreciate that. 